frustratingly straightforward, isn't it? <laughs> We've just had delivery of the three ton digger again. It's a very small machine, it's a bit too small, but actually it marks the end of a three day reign of just horrendous clay chopping and chipping and 85 wheelbarrows and that's probably two wheelbarrows. So we're gonna get this smashed out in the next five minutes, <laughs> whereas the whole thing would have taken five days. So today's really important. We've got to clear this like edge. And welcome to episode five at the playground, by the way. We've got to clear this edge to be able to ride the nine iron. Like we had before, to build the nine iron, we had to test the hip and get a feel for speed. And today I'm really excited to have a digger all day to clear this area, build a massive landing. And then tomorrow when the digger and dumper go back, we're gonna test out the nine iron and see how much speed we have. So this section here has a really, really cool name. A guy called Dino in the comments said, if you're gonna go with this golf course theme, and I said, and looked down here and said, that looks like a fairway. He said, call it the fairway to heaven, which I love. After the stairway to heaven, Led Zeppelin, come on, fairway to heaven, pretty cool name, golf themed. So this was my 85 wheelbarrows. And today we're gonna to have to, I mean, it's gonna be a serious shift, but it's not gonna be a shift on the spine. It's just gonna be a shift sat in that and that and I want to build a massive trick landing which I'd say is going to be another if it was wheelbarrows this would probably be a 700 wheelbarrow landing so the episodes would cease wouldn't they you'd have to wait a month to see a landing built but we're going to do it today because you guys gave me permission to get in machines and not break my own back and then we can clear all of that all the way through right up to this landing tomorrow and decide how big this jump can really be where we're going to put the takeoff and I'm thinking to start with I'm going to build a wooden kicker for this because it would be It'd be a shame to build a dirt kicker and it'd be in the wrong place. Whereas if we build out of wood, get this jump dialed so I can do backflip tail whoops on it, proper tricks that I never imagined I'd do in a set of homemade trails. We can then swap out the wooden kicker for a dirt one, knowing that it's prime and primo. And then we go again into episode six and seven and eight. And at some point soon, we're gonna be high enough up this hill where the speed will be reduced to potentially then go back in the other direction, back to the start, or just start a whole new line. We've got four and a half acres to plow through and a lot of time to do it. Jamie's back from his short trip away. You don't actually seem rested. You seem just excited to be back at the build, boy. Oh, you've been <laughs> restless, haven't you? Yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna sit in the digger all day. Ben, why don't you just do dumper runs? Yeah, I'm keen. The main thing is though, we've built a fence around this place. There's no way in through the rim. I might drive the digger across the dirt bridge actually. That would be. Yeah. Got ya. <laughs> Not gonna do it. We need to find a new <laughs> quarry for dirt in here. So I'm gonna have a little scoop about now and try and find the best stuff, see if there's any primo. If there's not, we've got about a kilometer route round just to drop three tons. <laughs> so actually, it would be better off on wheelbarrows. <laughs> right, we're gonna start this episode five off nice and early with a build lapse. Here we go.
Do you ever stand back and look at something and realize it's actually massive? <laughs> this was a two day build lapse again, and it's just, it's the sickest landing ever. Having that digger allowed this to happen. And I found a place for dirt, quarried, and it was actually a right job lot of stuff. If you look at this kind of leftover pile, there's sand, there was clay, there was turf, there was this weird red gritty sand, like sharp sand. It's all in there. We managed to create a sick landing. Like, there's no arguing that this is gonna be an insane trick jump. Especially after that, that was a cool time lapse, wasn't it? Us doing the entire step down landing off the nine iron. Look at that runway. It's a proper, proper launch pad. Fighter jets could be slung off that and into flight. <laughs> or hovercrafts could come down it and crash into the back of this massive wall. <laughs> Which is sick. As much as I love the digger work, we were doing digger dumper runs as you saw in the build laps. But I don't know, it must be typical for me. Like I, we always end up getting out of the machines and still doing stuff by hand. That side there only looks that good because we built it with all, all the big clay boulders that rolled off the pile and were around the edge. Jamie's giving this a clean today. It does, it does look sick. We built a wall out of those things, brick by brick. And because I couldn't get the digger in there, you see with a digger, it's great if you've got loads of space around a feature. And I discovered this at my compound with the row of trees and it's really relevant here. The back I was able to do with the machine and look really good. Banging it in with the bucket, scraping it down. That side a bit, but this side I was trapped. You can't get in, you can't get onto it. Without one of those tilt buckets that they use in some cool places, I had to just sit alongside it and just kind of do these real lame, eh. <laughs> <laughs> so we built a wall and I just kind of like for an hour just knocked it slowly with the side of the bucket and diggers don't have much strength in the 360 way like all the rams and levers work best pulling towards the machine not even pushing so they're designed just to pull spinning there's no strength in them like it doesn't take much to stop them spinning so that was like real you could have kicked it harder probably with a little <laughs> three ton digger but we've covered it in primo so what you get is a landing that's disguised as a perfect hand-built primo one but was actually built with heavy machinery, which are only, again, rented for a day. Loads of people have commented and say, why don't you buy a digger or why don't you hire one for longer? I'm not allowed to keep them here overnight because it's not really got an address. The playground doesn't come up yet on the Royal Mail search. So, well, not this one anyway. And then the back, if you stand right back, Ben, I kind of hate the shape, but I kind of love it that that side was done by hand and that wasn't. It's a bit rough. But... It's like the loaf of bread at the back of the aisle, isn't it? <laughs> you know, the one at the bottom of the pile that's just been a bit squidged, but you'll still buy it because it's got the orange sticker on it for a discount. <laughs> that's what we're going to ride. <laughs> but it's so wide, it's so sick. I, I don't know how much it weighs, but again, to build that with wheelbarrows would have been a task that I personally was not up for undertaking, but maybe would have done. <laughs> and then this is like when you do things properly. This is brilliant. That edge is superb it's ruler straight i love that it feeds you into that landing which I, this is like the first time i've actually stood back and look at it we just finished it then i can't wait we need to ride the nine iron and get a sense of speed which by the way is absolutely rock hard and then when we've done that we'll know how big to build the kicker which i'd say could at least be seven foot high it could be eight foot high but it's nice for those oh the sun's come out lovely it's nice for those features to be stepped up because i want to do bangers here i want to backflip no handle or flip whip that step down and then 720 this it would be a shame to build a set of these dirt jump trails that are so flowy that you can only do whips because i've got all of this place to build unique exclusive creative flowy lines especially in that dirt half pipe this this i wanted a trick jump i wanted a place to blast bangers so we're going to build a wooden lip in the next video and ride this entire course firstly please name this landing it's it's just massive i don't know what on a golf course is big and hefty <laughs> I assume the takeoff we're going to call like the driver or the wood because it's going to send you so high but that landing needs a name it actually blocks out the sun massive so as promised I've got a bike with me in fact I'll go and get it now you might not recognize this piece my bike the white one the special one is at the London bike show on show I'm going there tomorrow to do a signing session so for this one I've taken out my spare bike which is actually the one Ben rode in La Poma it's kind of Ben's it's more mine really not got ownership of anyone but you've ridden it more than me <laughs> The brake's on the wrong side for me, which shows it's yours because French do everything <laughs> wrong and back then. Um, I'm going to ride the 9 iron. It's quite windy, but everything up to this point looks superb. It's so, so absurdly hard now. Ah, oh, it's getting hard, but it's dry. And Jamie's used all the water this morning, building up those sides. Thirsty boy. So we've got no, we've got no water to wet them. So I'm just going to do a couple of runs. Oh, it's so windy. It's very windy. It's like a slight cross. Is this sun blinding? Oh, Kind of. No, it's, yeah, it's, all the variables are out wrong. <laughs> the factors don't work. This doesn't feel like mine. 
Nice, can't even do a fakey. Good luck, mate. <laughs> I've, rid I've ridden two jumps in the last month and you filmed them. Yeah. So you really think I can ride backwards when I'm struggling to ride forward? <laughs> Place your bets, what's going to happen? I'm going to land the hip perfectly using the tailwind. I'm not going to pump this because I don't want the extra speed. I don't want to land flat. Massive crash. Run up that lip now and film imagining going flat. Spinal. No, flat, not flat. Oh, flat. Complete Hang on. spinal. Shall I throw my camera? No, I don't Sick, I'm just going to do it. You'll be all right, mate. Just me. You're out, aren't you, because of the wind? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Loads Can you just promise me in episode yep. six when we build the wooden lip, yep. that new name jump, you'll yep. ride the whole line? I promise you. Repeat after me. I solemnly swear. I solemnly swear. That I'll ride the full line. That I will ride the full line. And I'll 180 something and do a fake. And I'll 180 something and do a fake. And Jamie, I promise. I promise. To do my best. To do my best. For my country. <laughs> for my country. And ride the first hit. And ride the first Thank hit. Thank you. Nice. Big promises from the gang. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you've seen this, let's show you that. Let's go. I've not even been up here for two days. Spent so much time in that digger down the bottom. Boys, it looks sweet from here. Yeah, I'm more nervous for this than the hip, that's for sure. And again, please don't judge me on my first run. Dodgy shoulder. First run on a scary blind step down. It's going to be an anti-climax, but climax nonetheless. Ready? I'm, a, I'm honestly going to not make it look very cool because I just want to land on the landing. I do make some things look cool, Ben. Not to you and your French vibes. Come in. It's got faster. It's got faster. Yes! Oh! Yes! Oh, it's so good! We built that! <laughs> wow, you were bombing. I don't know if there's not even a mark on the landing. I don't know if it was the tailwind or um, that the ground's just got so hard that it rolls immensely fast. But even I did land a bit deep, didn't I? No, no, not that deep. But I didn't go high. I didn't pump the pump. I overshot the first. There's so many areas I could improve. You did go really wide on the hip. I thought it was wind induced. <laughs> yeah, maybe. It's, it's all way better. Maybe it's the spare bike. <laughs> and my main observation, you'll probably all agree, is there's a ton of speed. You were going fast. So like... 360s really have become 720s and flips have become double flips at the playground and the playground it is i'm gonna go again <laughs> and try and go a little bit higher are you watching f1 qualifying while you film yeah we are that's Look, nice red bull yeah that's good timing hopefully you don't go too quick anyway but higher higher oh my god look at this place the fairway to heaven looks great with a fat loaf of bread on it you ready the nine iron Go a little bit faster and higher. Yes! Yes! It's big! It's big! Look, I'm up here. I just turned right and felt like the line could go up here. Damn. Not actually, we could go up here. Whoa, look what we've built. Mate, it looks huge. I went a little bit higher, but I still, I cased the hips. So I've had the best of both worlds. Let me do one more now. Get Third it. time's the charm, see you in a sec. <laughs> oh! oh! Yes! It doesn't get better than building something that takes that much work and it's that fun. Mate, it's yes. insane. Actually insane. What are we going to do about the speed? <laughs> Is the loaf even big enough? <laughs> the loaf? You've already named I it. I know, we could have gone full farmhouse. Instead we've gone for some like <laughs> small little deli tiger loaf. <laughs> um, I, I can't wait for this to let feel more stable because I could 360 that eat like sounding like such a brag I could 360 <laughs> I could flip it I can't get the hang of the hip yet I'm casing aren't I Jamie yeah yeah very yeah, unstylish on that mate someone messaged me on Instagram a drawing of a landing here and saying why don't you hip off of that down oh it could be even lower it could be like this high yeah that's an idea, but first we've got to build a wooden kicker in episode six. You two are riding, you're brakeless. Yeah. Good luck afterwards, there's so much speed. <laughs> and also, I'll talk about this more further, but after that jump, I want to split. Before we start another line, I want to just continue that one and make it split. So, not what do you want to see there, but what features do you want to see built of any size, whether they're big, small, medium. We could do it over there. What do you want us to build? 
on your ideas it's always been so valuable i think the step down was someone's idea that definitely was so is it oh i don't know <laughs> let's get a loop the loop <laughs> legends <laughs>